Oh my god, actually. <laughs> wow. Not me thinking, oh, let me just record this intro, outro real quick. But I actually look kind of bummy. Um, <clears throat> now that I say you don't look bummy, you look fly. Okay, let's start again. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Tanessa. Love, love. And I'm giving this blogging thing a try, okay? Mm, sorry to interrupt little missy here forgot to mention that this is my first vlog ever like ever <laughs> um i obviously do many vlogs on tiktok and insta but like this is my first youtube vlog so cut me some slack and thank you okay back to her mm. um i am moving from my house no i live in a flat um i've lived in this flat since i moved to london three and a half years ago and it is so bittersweet that i'm leaving so bittersweet like i handed the keys in today and <laughs> the realtor was looking at me like are you gonna cry i didn't cry but it was very bittersweet that's the only place i know you know like living there for three and a half years is the only place i've known to live since being here so bittersweet but onto new memories new things um new experiences um the flat was a one bedroom it was a big one bedroom and if you know me i have a lot of things i have way too many things it was still a lot to move um but yeah so everything is in now in here now handed the keys over for the new place uh, for the old place and this is where we are we basically took about like a week or two weeks to fully move so it gave me time to really pack up my stuff and one of the first things i started to pack was my bag wall honestly i saw this girl i cannot for the life of me remember what her tiktok name is but i saw that she had a bag wall and because i had nowhere else in the apartment to put my bags and the collection was growing i just thought like how cute is this idea so it was perfect because it was also in front of a mirror the only thing is that with the new place i won't have a bag wall i'll just have to find somewhere to put it like i didn't want to turn the room into like a full beauty room because we're doing like a half half like a beauty room slash second bedroom you know yeah love my bags i basically did let me tell you what i did at about two years ago I realized I was struggling with accessories and I'm still trying to grow my accessories now like my bags my glasses jewelry that kind of thing what I did with my bags and shoes last year was when there was end of summer sale I basically bought every a, a pair of every color in the rainbow and that basically works with everything <laughs> so I bought one bag in every color one heels in every color so that I'll always have a bag and a heel that color coordinated boom there's your tip thank me later next thing i need to attack is my beauty section it doesn't always look like this but a lot of times it does <laughs> i already have like three two or three hair product boxes but that's the last one but i don't want to pack it away yet until i finish this desk Let's see what else can fit Do we bring back the suitcases? Well, yeah, because I have more clothes. He's been complaining that everything that he's moved so far are all my things. Sounds like a you problem. It's really... No, okay. <laughs> it's really a me problem. <laughs> huh? Is that what you were going to say? I didn't even know where I was going to go with it. I, I, I'm going to leave it. Good job. And now I'm tired of packing things. Oh, you're not so, my dearest. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what a time to be a woman. Wait, let me turn on the light for now. <laughs> Bye! This is 
one thing I'm not gonna miss. The five stairs, five story stairs. Yeah, this is why I didn't leave my flat. Yeah, I'm not gonna miss that. That's why I didn't leave my flat, cause who climbing those stairs? Um, and now I'm getting an elevator. <laughs> But I'm still not going to leave my flat. But this is day three of moving. S moving slowly. Which is a good thing. Like we, the tendency for this place overlaps with the tendency for the new place. So we can drive and go back and forth. Um, to like drop stuff off. Pick some stuff up. Unpack if we can. And just make the move like more slow and less stressful. Which is really good. Um, but... It just means that we have more time in this place that just makes me get more sad because I love, love, love this place. I love the location. I love the space. Like I've been here almost four years now. Since I, ever since I moved to London, I've been in this apartment. So it's bittersweet, but new beginnings. New beginnings. <laughs> it feels so empty now. Like the walls are empty. There was picture frames here. I mean, I still have my little lampshade, but everything in this feels so empty like there was a picture frame there i still have my plant but there's just everything just around you know it's so messy but we'll get there we're sorting everything out um okay so let's go to the other apartment and let's unload these things. Actually, I don't even think I got unpacked. No. I'm not getting unpacked tonight. We're just going to drop them off. Clean, make some... Um, yeah, we're just going to drop them off. Clean up some stuff. So we can start like unpacking the kitchen things. And then we go from there. Okay, I have... A lot of shoes um i already have a full box and i need another box i might need two boxes hold on let me show you so that big one is one box this is another box i'm trying to fill um with the shoes in here there's also shoes over there so I don't know where they can go. <laughs> Let's go again. Ariel, you going with him? Huh? You going with him? Oh my Two hours later. Then, mommy, you know, say, you know, say, don't come back. No, um, Monday, but we are, we are good Sunday. What are we with you? Oh. Anyway, so we are pack up with something now. We call it Hikis. Find a place. Yeah. Oh, he did? Um, and so may I pack up my shoes? Oh, my shoes then can't fit in my box. Why? Ah! <laughs> because I have too much shoes! Okay, 
you. It is moving day. Fantastic. Oh my God. I didn't know it's going to be so tiring. But let me tell you one thing I love about England. If you have an idea, best believe it already exists as a business. <laughs> like I was saying to Alex, I am not going to be going up those five flights of stairs with my temper mattress that I'm not leaving anywhere, by the way. Those mattresses are golden. Um, and just like all the couch and stuff, I'm not going to be the one going up and down those stairs. And some of those like moving companies are really expensive. So my friend recommended this um, app, Task Rabbit. I think that's what it's called. And it's basically like, it just has a bunch of people renting their services out on there, whether it's moving house, whether it's, um, I don't know, like setting up furniture, plumbers, all those things. So it's, you don't have to go through a company or anything. You basically talk to an individual person offering their services on TaskRabbit. Tell me, why is that so perfect? Perfect. So that's what we did. We got these guys um, and they basically like took down and up. What was it called? They basically disassembled our bed frame and our couch and then like packed it all in their van, drove behind us to the new place, and then they reassembled it. All three, four hours, honestly, best thing. So all me and Alex had to do really was move like the smaller stuff with the car um, and like unpack when they were unloading the bigger things. It was absolutely great. So thousand percent recommend. Um, but yeah, if you guys, I mean, obviously this is not an ad, Tass Rabbit don't know who I am, but, <laughs> but it made the move so easy for us that I think like if you have the funds to do it, literally just invest in that and it'll take the hassle, I think, out of you, um, stressing about the day. It's one less thing to stress about, basically. There's other things, but the moving and the heavy lifting and hurting your back is one less thing. I think, to think about. This bedroom is an absolute mess. Basically, this is the second bedroom and we were kind of dumping everything in there. When yeah, Actually, when I say dumping, that's a lie, you know, because if Alex watched this, he's going to be like, all of that is yours, which is true. But that's not what we're talking about. Um, so I was dumping all of my stuff in there, basically. So it's out of the way. And it's like a mess that you can lock away and still function because I still have to go to work. There are people coming through the flat and stuff. So it was just like keeping everything in there. Oh, look at my, look at my squat. Oh, that, no, nope, that didn't, no, nope, never mind. I was going to say, look at my, <laughs> look at my form, my squat form coming in. But it wasn't because Alex still had to bring that in. That's fine. That's fine. That's what he's here for, friends. Right, babe? Let the record state that he had no comment. But yeah, while moving, we also both had to work. Um, so we would take like our lunch break to move some stuff over and drive things over after the big moving day. Um, and then like work from the new place. Cause we both work, we both mostly work from home. Um, so I would have meetings, he would have meetings, and we'll do it from the new place, work there, and then unpack some stuff, and then go back and forth to the old place and the new place. So that's everything moved in. Um, it's such a mess. <laughs> it's such a mess in here. But the approach I'm taking is I'm not going to try to decorate everything um, at the same time, I'm also not going to try decorating right now. At least I don't think so. I say that and I'm going to see something in um, in the store and then go buy it. But needless to say, I'm going to try prioritizing packing away the stuff first. You know, like organize chaos for a little bit. And then once I see how everything fits, then I'll start decorating um, the place how I want. Because it feels very bare. It feels very empty. Or I don't even know if it's a London thing or... It's a very UK thing where all the bedrooms are white and grey. And I don't want that. But I also want this beauty room to be black and white. Like I saw the most beautiful, um, I saw the most beautiful black and white inspo for this room. And that's what I'm going to go for. When I say this room, I mean the room that I'm in now, which is a beauty room slash second bedroom.
I'm gonna have a space. I'm gonna have a space to do this. I'm gonna have a space to do all the mess of the makeup. All the mess of the makeup that's next to me. You know. So yeah, thanks for watching my vloggy vlogs. <laughs> um, I'm gonna try to also share with you guys like when I'm ready to actually decorate. Um what my plan is and how this is gonna go but also if you don't follow me on tiktok tiktok is the quickest way for me to like show daily stuff um so if you want a short shorter form quick kind of what's going on with the new place tiktok is going to be the place to be i think um so follow me over there as well thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye